What we've been doing this last year is way bigger than I had in my dreams, the Ponca and Ojibwe writer and producer Migizi Pensano said recently. You think it's going to be this incremental thing and then suddenly there are these two massive TV shows, and the aftershocks are going to be massive, too. The two shows he is referring to are, Reservation Dogs, which arrives Monday on FX on Hulu, and, Rutherford Falls, which premiered in April on the NBC Universal streaming service Peacock, and has been renewed for another season. They are vastly different comedies. The first, created by Sterling Harjo and Taika Waititi, Thor, Ragnarok, is a genre mixing series about four indigenous teenagers in Oklahoma. The second, from Sierra Teller Ornillas, Superstore, Michael Schur, The Good Place, and Ed Helms, The Office, is a sweetly biting sitcom that re-examines an upstate New York town's colonial history. But what they share is that they are both native stories told largely by native actors, writers, producers and directors. The upshot has been a flourishing of new opportunities for Hollywood's small but growing community of native creators and performers, many of whom worked on both shows. They are determined to ensure that this long-awaited moment for Native American representation on television is not a fleeting one. Right now, you have a whole bunch of people on the come up that have a much different point of view than has been seen in the world so far, said Pensano, an actor on, Rutherford Falls, and writer on, Reservation Dogs. The otherwise dissimilar series also illustrate that a, native show, can be anything, and suggest the multitude of different indigenous stories available to an entertainment industry that has rarely tapped into them, said Tazba Chavez, a writer on, Rutherford Falls, and writer-director on, Reservation Dogs. Networks and studios, feel like they're running out of stories, it's because they have a 200-year-old story, said Chavez, a citizen of the Bishop Paiute tribe. We've got thousands of years. Pensano added. The fact that we're all native doesn't preclude us for from being in a global space, it actually makes us much richer. In a group video call last month, Pensano, Chavez, the Navajo director Sidney Freeland, the Lakota actor and writer Jana Schmieding, the Mohawk actor Devery Jacobs and the Sisseton Wapetan Dakota actor and writer Bobby Wilson, who all worked on both, Reservation Dogs, and, Rutherford Falls, discussed the Native American experience in the TV industry and the importance of opening doors for others. These are edited excerpts from the conversation. Rutherford Falls, and, Reservation Dogs, both debuted this year, on big mainstream platforms. What factors do you think led to this confluence? Sydney Freeland Taika doing, Thor, and becoming a household name. That made people think maybe there are other indigenous filmmakers who have stories as well.